we celebrate the arrival of God's general, Reverend Father A.G. Kimbaka, Anaye Uchafi Maka. These are the words of Evangelist Ebukobi of Zion Prayer Movement Outreach. Yesterday, during the open heaven greetings my beautiful people and welcome back to abyss castle if you are new here you are welcome in this video we are going to be talking about reactions seen in the videos that i made last night regarding the arrival of father ag came back i am going to be responding to some of the comments okay here we have a lot of beautiful comments coming from adora zionize and many much more people that love him and mm -hmm. He has imparted in their life in so many ways. You see this crowd you are seeing right here in this video. These people, in one way or the other, this man, Reverend Father A.G. Kimbaka, has imparted in their life. We will be starting with this one. This one is from Amaka. I said, welcome back, Reverend Father, but please stay off political issues, especially OB matters. And here are some responses from it. Mbaka is not meant to shut up when God asks him to speak. We all love P.O. That's P.O.B. But telling Mbaka to stay off his matters is a no-no affair. Okay, responding to some comments, some replies, she went further to say, Obi is the president, no going back. We will use him when he enters as a president to get Biafra. So if you guys want to cry, please start now. You know, a lot of people were telling her that this, that I think it's not right for you to talk about um, Mbaka staying of political affairs and all that and all that. Okay, here I said, this Sandra Oyi said, let your vote count leave mbaka alone he is a nigerian and he has every legal right to voice out his mind just like every other person besides he didn't ask you to vote for his choice you have your pvc so do the needful and leave innocent man alone okay this one is actually telling her that he has his right to choice of words that he can choose anybody he wants to choose but it's left for you to make use of your pvc and vote for whoever it is that you wanted to vote for and you want to vote for okay let's go further to other comments now this is coming from pookie james forgive me if i did not pronounce your name well he said rubbish then the response is here said to you is rubbish but to us it is jubilation go and hug him okay oh yeah i don't know is it oh you're gone go more oh, you're going more responding to the comment the reply he went for that to say that they have used your brain and make money you don't have <laughs> again jubilation over nothing fake pastors everywhere I mean, this one I'll be responding to you, Pocky or Pocky Jane. Um, you are not a judge. You are not made a judge ever over any human, okay? You don't judge. You don't tell us who is fake and who is not fake and who is a real pastor here and who is not a real pastor. I keep saying it in most of my videos. I said, it's okay for you to worship whatever you want to worship serve whatever you want to serve but don't discourage others from their belief don't discourage others from what they believe in okay now saying that um this person's brain has been used i don't think is worth it all right i mean no harm i'm just reacting to the comments seen in my post okay let's go further guys mr man calm down it's too early to cry okay okay there are so many replies and many more replies from people on this particular comment but like i said i won't be responding to all of them we just pick a little of it and maybe on your free time you can go back if you are interested you can go back to read okay here from another post this one said this is not from my page okay this one said please my brother help him to help tell him that people like us don't want to hear him talk about anything concerning this coming election next month okay thank you <laughs> this one is just like pleading with the poster to please tell him not to 
say anything regarding this election again because you know the other the other time i, I was telling us about how baka lost so many followers during this issue of him and peter obi he lost a lot of followers more like a lot of people were like what is this why will he be supporting someone else instead of supporting uh, his own people after saying that p2b is a stingy man that he did not just support he did not just said no i p2b god said p2b will not rule he just said it plainly that a stingy man cannot rule nigeria and a lot of people were like criticizing what he said okay going further to another comment we have here this one says okay it says please tell him to keep quiet this time Atiku and Tinubu will now come and give him money to give him fake prophecy against Obi. Okay. And another one said, I'm sure he is not back to put confusion in the middle of the day and let him check very well if he's not forgotten something important in America that he should go back and have them until March and his way back we will welcome him in a special way not like this oh my god this one is talking about more like he is the way i'm seeing it a lot of people don't want him to show up they don't want him to show his face until the election is over you know the kind of thing people like what is he going to say this time around what does he have to say this time around you know a whole lot of things people will be thinking he will start speaking against p2b again and he'll start raising issues against p2b giving fake prophecies and all that but me i feel like everybody have their own freedom of speech okay you choose to say what you want to say that's why i said hold your pvc is your right you are the one to vote forgetting what or whichever thing anybody says you are the one to do the voting so you hold your pvc and exercise your right it doesn't matter what anybody says fine we want peter obi right then hold your pvc and vote for peter obi okay for this last comment is still the same thing i keep saying you have the right as a human being to serve whatever you want to serve believe in whatever you want to believe that but never discourage others from their belief okay my beautiful people like my words always say in the world of today where everybody is serving what they know where everybody is choosing their belief i hope if you know this god if you know this jesus we are talking about you hold on to him and you hold on to him very well knowing fully well that at the right time he makes everything perfect for his people if you have watched this video to this extent please tell me what you think about the reactions from people what's your own suggestion and what's your own opinion okay my beautiful people thank you for staying here with me ab of ab castle i'll see you guys in my next video bye bye